What's up, Sim Races? This is Larry TJR Sim here, and today I wanted to look at a uh, a couple things from Sim Sports Gadget, uh, which I'd uh, reached out to to well just order something online. I'd gotten a uh, bezel kit from them. I'm sorry, I got a bezel kit from Amazon and an ASUS one, which works for 27 inch monitors, of course, and you need an extension to make these work for your for say your 32 inch monitors, which is what I have. I have uh, triple screens, uh, as you've probably seen in videos, 1440p, uh, 32, 32 inch monitors. So I needed a bezel kit and uh, I keep seeing all the videos with them on there and it looks like they came back in stock, so I got some. Uh, but then of course I need the extension. So I ordered some up from Sim Sports Gadget and then also at the same time I, I got a uh, speaker kit from uh, Logitech, a, I think it's a G560. I'll show up, I'll flash a picture up uh, on the screen here. And um, I needed to attach it to my rig as well. So I needed some shelving. And I'm like, how am I gonna attach this to my rig? And so I got to looking when I was looking at, for the bezel kits, I saw that they had make shelving too. So I uh, got the biggest one, the 200 meter, millimeter by 200 millimeter shelving kit here, which came out looking actually really good. Nice high quality B printing. I really love the way this actually looks uh, nice nice curt nice radiuses in here everything just no sharp edges just really clean high quality uh be printing i like it it's really good you don't even have some of the uh the line strains but apparently 3d printing has come along a good ways from the last time i've uh, messed around with uh getting some three 3D printed parts. So yeah, really enjoying this. This is really cool. So this will be really nice and sturdy to hold these speakers up. That's just a 2.1 system, but I needed something to attach. And I was just going to attach them to my monitor stands because as you know, I got motion and I don't want to have these rocking and rolling all over the place. So got some shelving. Just wanted to do a quick video and review of this quality of quality work here that we get here. And it looks like they put a little, uh, uh, another 3D printed here that they uh, of course, screwed into the sign side here. So you got an actual complete shelf on there. So this being, if you set it like this, you got mounting hardware that you would attach to the left. And then this one, of course, attached to the right, but you got a complete tray here, obviously, as you can see, with this extra bolted on piece that they put on for me already. Uh, yeah, I got a tray for it not to slide slide in and out. So got a little bit oversized than what I needed. I thought they had a 150 by 150 millimeter and that was a little bit too small and uh, for my needs. Uh, so I needed really about 165. So I just did a 200 by 200. So yeah, really happy with this quality. It looks really good. It's a shelf, right? So I mean, <laughs> but you know, really what this is about is accessorizing your rig to work for you, right? And uh, so it's got some really good gear here. So I just wanted to point this out and put it out there for y'all that probably looking for some solutions to mount your speakers up to your rig. And then obviously, um, I'm sure that's what's pretty popular is the uh, the bezel kit. But staying on the, uh, on the shelving, you can actually order it with where, if you want it to, which I did. Uh, so here you go, comes with the hardware, these little, uh, oh, I forgot what we call these now. Anyway, <laughs> these are little, little spring type ones. They're a little bit different than what I'm used to using. I'm used to using the, the ball bearing ones, but yeah, works fine. Put it in spot and it won't slide up and down for you. Comes with the appropriate length hardware. Nice uh, big screws here. Looks like M8s right here. So man, way, way bigger than you would need to hold this, this bad boy up. So yeah, that's really good. So yeah, got a set of that. And also I didn't even know it, excuse the sound. I didn't know it even came with it or not, but also I included some uh, 3D printed clips, some wire clips here. So I just want to show you that as well. Looks like we got a few different sizes in here. Take these out of the bag. So some smaller ones and of course some bigger ones. I don't know if they just threw that in because it's Christmas time or not, but I appreciate it. Or if it normally comes with a kit. I'm not sure I have to go back and look and see if it does come with a kit. But yeah, pretty cool. Do the same thing, 80-20 rig. Squeeze them, slide them in there release out and hold it in spot right so you can run your wire uh, obviously run your wire through it and then clip it on where you need it right so pretty cool like that now to go on to the uh to the other uh as far as the uh, bezel kit here goes here's some of the 3d printed parts these are the upper 
and lower extensions of the brackets. But again, let me get this in camera. Hope that comes in focus there. Yeah, really nice, sharp, uh, pre 3D printed uh, pieces here. So I like it. Uh, and I did pre-test them with the bezel kit and they fit perfectly. Just a very snug fit, doesn't slide around. And uh, comes with instructions, of course, here too. And it has... here too and it has these extensions here which i didn't know what they were at first but uh when you have your bezel kit you know you slide them on here uh for the tops of your monitor because a lot of times our monitors are pretty thin so this is an extra gap you know take up that extra gap for you so yeah really cool even beveled here as well and and, and a nice snug fit these are rubber handles anyway so it has a nice you know it doesn't you don't really have to worry about it sliding around on and off there so that's kind of a plus that comes from ASUS anyways for grip on your monitors, but able to take advantage of that with drilling a proper size or casting a proper size hole in here. So pretty cool. Uh, also, <laughs> for those uninitiated, they give you instructions here as well uh, of uh, you know what each part you expect to have in this kit. And then of course, how they fit, even saying, pay close attention to the, uh, to the bevel side here. Uh, being closer to the monitor because obviously you got a monitor at a at an angle, right? And so that's gonna be closer to take up that gap in the monitor on the on the monitor side, right? So uh, Same on both of them, but pretty sweet. But yeah, that's just a quick look at some uh, SimSport gadget uh, gear that I uh, Just got and here's some rest of the instructions of how it should look as well on the back nice printed colored printed instructions love it Man, can't ask for anything better there. So really sweet. I like this. Really good stuff. So uh, I don't have an affiliate link with them yet. I did apply for one, but if if I uh, do acquire one, I'll put it in the uh, in the description box for you to to use as well to help out the channel and maybe I get some discounts uh, for uh, the people that watch the videos, right? Uh, that I can pass on to y'all. I don't know. We'll see. But all right, that is it. High quality stuff. I'm loving it. Really digging it. Can't wait to get this installed. All right. Well, that's it for me. Y'all have a, uh, uh, hopefully you had a Merry Christmas and have a happy, happy new year. See you on the track. I'm out.